In this scenario, we have a customer who's on a hotel booking site and is on the phone with a customer service representative. The customer service representative is going to start a co-browse session using a short code to enable them to co-browse while on the phone. The agent tells the customer to navigate to the bottom of the page where they can find a link to get a sh short code for co-browse. So they click that link and they read back 814010. Now we'll switch to the agent view to see where they enter that information. They click the Cobra shortcode link, they paste in that number that the customer told them over the phone, and then they click Start to start the Cobra session. On the agent side, that opens a new window so they can see the customer's whole browser, and you can see that we can see the customer's browser. Let's switch back to the customer view. You can see uh, an orange bar showing what they're showing of their screen and that they are in a Cobra session. On the agent side, they're going to use the annotate and spotlight tools to tell the customer to click the Book Now button. The customer is going to switch to that view and we'll click the Book Now button. Now the agent sees the customer form on the Book Now page and can type in some information on behalf of the customer. In this case, they're going to type the first name, last name, and email address. Then they're going to use the Spotlight tool to tell the customer to fill in the address field. We'll switch to the customer view to show that experience. So the customer can see that spotlight and that circling, and they'll type in their address and then press the continue button when they're finished. On the customer side, the agent's pointing uh, to the extras that are available as part of their stay. And we'll switch back to the agent view. The agent has pushed a file using CoBrowse and is showing the customer um, some of the premium golf course holes that are available as part of their stay. The customer has to accept that uh, image file and they can see in real time the agent annotating and, and circling that PDF or image file as well. So all of this is happening not inside of a chat, but simply inside of a voice call. Um, now the customer is going to put in their credit card information, and you can see on the agent side that those fields are redacted because the agent doesn't need to know the credit card number. Um, for security purposes, they can help the customer fill in the rest of the fields without having exposure to that PII. So um, the customer is going to go ahead and fill in that information. Again, the agent doesn't see any of that. And then when they click the Submit Payment button, their process will be complete. So here's the customer side of that, filling in that credit card information, and you'll see that we did not see any of that on the agent side. We just saw those black fields, and um, the customer is going to go type their name, which we did see them fill in live, and submit payment. And that concludes um, the transaction, and the agent will end the co-browse session.